Back at Case Blue, man, it's still the 26th of December, uh, is that right? Yeah, I've got one more turn to get through the December month, and it's the, uh, the Soviet's turn, and we are, uh, the, we've finished their movement, we've conducted their air, we have executed the uh, reaction phase, and we're about to be combat. And uh, what I wanted to point out was here, I went all out with air uh, for the Soviets this turn and uh, spared no expense, uh, reduced a couple of units and forced everybody else inactive in these two airports here, airfields here. Uh, it ran a, a small handful of attacks, only got one DG here. In the reaction phase, the Germans uh, DG this stack here, which is going to negatively impact that attack. Whoa! Pate foul. There we go. New tweezers, by the way. And let's see, this guy. Now, I don't remember whether he was face up, face down, but it doesn't matter because he's not going to attack this time. Um, and then down here. This is where the Soviets have broken through the trace supply line for the Germans. Uh, this is a trace extender here with a brigade protecting it. And the Germans attempted to, uh, well, what, they, what, they German, what the Germans did here was uh, DG this unit. Um, so we weren't able to do anything in terms of reacting and uh, making any combats in the reserve phase because we had no units in reserve. So the, the Soviets are going to get a free attack on this uh, little regiment that's protecting the extender. The, this could be really ugly uh, for the Germans. Uh, but it's a pretty meager little counterattack. Uh, I've got one unit set up here for exploit or a little stack. Um, We'll see what happens. Out of all the other stuff that's going on, that is really about all I was able to pull together. Uh, I did, oh, I didn't roll for this air up here. You know what, let's do that. Flak. Uh, oh, roll seven for flax, that's okay. And then a two. And this is what, see, this is what happens. I roll this sort of shit all day long for the Soviets. And, and it happens occasionally for the Germans, but for the Germans it doesn't matter, they're making five times as many attacks. Oh, anyway, so then down here, uh, we're, we're just, we're trading space for time and pulling back as far as we can, except for around Rostov, where everything has a uh, decent hedgehog. And uh, we're, we're trying to reinforce this river line here. This is a particularly difficult part of the map to actually get to. Uh, and play on. And if we do uh, continue into January based on you know whatever assessment we make of the situation with the game, and if we do continue with the either if we continue with perhaps half the set of maps, I'm going to have to I'm going to have to think about changing the uh, the arrangements here because I really can't get at uh, anything in there comfortably. And I've even short sheeted one of the maps down the end there so that there's a little bit of reach. But this this little corner here helps me get in there. But uh, I may have to turn everything around and, and face it the other way so that uh, it's it's um, all the right way around for me to see. Anyway, uh, no further action there. We've got to do supply uh, for the Soviets. In fact, I should have done supply. Uh, for some reason I got that out of sequence. You know why? Because there's nothing out of supply up the other end of the map. I didn't really move anything down here other than one, one or two little stacks. And there was no reaction phase down here. So, and the only guys that need to roll for supply are these dudes right here. They're all mostly isolated. Everything else is either dead or running away. Lost two trucks and a wagon last turn. Uh, and this is the Soviet back-to-back -back turn, so the, the Germans are, are going to be in a little bit of a pickle when they come into their, their, their game turn, but overall I think they're going to be fine. So anyway, we'll do, we'll roll for supply, 
get the German get the German turn done and then we will be heading into the last turn of December which would be three four months of this uh, combined thing going and then we'll uh, do a stock take of the situation have a look at the plan that we built uh, in October game time and see how uh, the adjustments in November have worked and see what uh, what we've actually done that's worked and not worked for both sides and kind of go out from there talk to you soon